Well, one year on, uh, we've brought the bus back. This is again part of our national tour, 30 cities to promote entrepreneurship. And Birmingham is the, the heart of entrepreneurship in, in the Midlands. It has a fantastic population. It's got uh, several great universities and just a really good entrepreneurial spirit. So we, we were delighted to come back and uh, inspire more you know, aspiring and early stage entrepreneurs. Matt, I understand that the research that you've carried out so far, it's shown that more businesses have started up in the first six months of this year than in comparison to last year, is that right? Yeah, so Birmingham, uh, as with a lot of other places in the country, is seeing an ever-increasing rate of entrepreneurship. More people start starting businesses, um, and you know, the rates for the first six months of this year are on target to match and in, indeed exceed uh, the total number last year. Why do you think the numbers increase this year then? I think it's... Um, a cumulative effect. You know, Birmingham, as with the rest of the country, more people are starting businesses, more people know people starting businesses, there's more ideas out there, um, and Britain as a whole is, is getting more entrepreneurial. I guess this year has been really interesting, what with Brexit, but you know, what's the research shown surrounding Brexit and, and indeed pre referendum? So we did not see a slowdown in business startups uh, before the referendum or after the referendum. I think from my perspective, entrepreneurship is a personal endeavor. If you're wanting to take an idea and turn it into, into action, you know, it's, it is your passion that will drive that forward. And you know, there was always risk, there was always uncertainty on the horizon. Brexit, particularly now uh, in the current stage where there is a bit of uncertainty and we don't know what's next, um, it's another uncertainty that entrepreneurs are dealing with and cracking on with regardless. Is it a scary time for business? I think there's certainly uncertainty, but when is there not uncertainty for, for entrepreneurs, really? Um, I think the larger firms are probably um, uh, feeling a little more uncertain and uh, will find it harder to, to tackle these changes, but nimble, small entrepreneurs always jumping around to, to overcome obstacles.